So you don't want to wait for the user's consent to send a follow-up message. Well, the solution is a paid message broadcast. Let me show you in this video how you can send a message broadcast and you can pay to play so you don't have to wait for the user's consent. Let me show you, just stay tuned. Hey, my name is Ana Andrea and in this channel you will be learning about chat marketing, customer service tips and tricks, neuromarketing, and more techie tutorials of my favorite tools. Enjoy the next video. Okay, so we're here inside uh, my ManyChat account and we're going to go to the menu on, the, on my left hand side. Here we're going to click on where it says broadcasting. If you see this broadcast, you're going to be able to send uh, follow-up messages with the three tags. Go to the video up here. I'm going to link it so you can see the three tags video. That's part of this series of videos on me showing you how you can send messages to your ManyChat list without having to uh, pay for all of them. In this case, I'm going to show you the paid version, right? But on the videos on here that I'm going to link up here, um, I show you the way you can use the three tags and the one-time notification option. So let's get started. Um, I'm here and we're going to click on the paid message option on the left menu down here and we're going to activate the paid messages I'm Gonna click on activate paid messages while we're waiting remember to subscribe click on the like button for this video also on the little bell so you can get notified when I upload another video to help you become irresistible online using technology for your business. So let's see. It says ManyChat would like to manage your ads. We're going to click on OK. And this is how we can send paid messages through ManyChat. What we're going to do is we're going to click on the button, blue button that says create paid message. And then it says select an ad account. It says that it seems you don't participate in any Facebook ads account. I got to associate it with a business manager. This cannot be done with a normal Facebook ads account. It has to be a business manager ads account. So if you don't have one, go to business.facebook.com and just make one, okay? So we're going to create an ad account on Facebook. We don't need to create one. I already have one. So um, I'm going to just link it up. In this case, I'm just going to create one just for the sake of this tutorial. Okay. Um, it's telling me here to select from one of these businesses. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select this one. Okay. So we're going to add the page here on the business manager at a page I own. We're going to look for it. Here it is, and then we're gonna add page, and this is my Instagram and my Facebook. Yes, that it, it, that's it, and I'm gonna click on add all. It's gonna ask me to sign into Instagram, so we're gonna sign into Instagram. Okay close it's added now we got to add the ad account okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a new ad account we're gonna put a name on this we're gonna click on next then we're gonna add, who will this ad account be used for? My business. And this turned into a Facebook ads 
tutorial, but that's okay. We're gonna select all this. We're gonna select the person, and then we're gonna select manage campaigns, view performance, and manage ad account. We're gonna assign it, and then we're gonna close. Then we're gonna here go to add people. I'm gonna add myself. Okay, so once we added the ad account uh, on your Facebook and did all the business manager stuff, that's another tutorial for another day, so that's not for it right now. We're going to go back to the paid messages and um, we're gonna go back to ManyChat and we go to the broadcasting section and then back to paid messages. We're gonna click on create paid messages and then it's gonna ask me to select the ad account. We select the ad account. We click on select. Assuming you have set up your ad account and also set up your payment information and all of that jazz on your business manager, all right? So we go here, we create the message. It doesn't have a lot of options. All you could do is add a card. So if you have like a, a restaurant you can, or a e-commerce store or a program that you're launching and you wanna put the image of the product there, of the info product or the physical product, enter a title and a subtitle, you can. Um, I, for example, I'm subscribed to Rihanna's uh, chatbot and I get messages sponsored once in a while. The last message I got was one card with an image and it asked me if I wanted to uh, get subscribed to their promotions that are going on right now. So, and that's fine and I didn't get upset or anything because I love Fenty, right? So, people are not gonna get upset. Um, by getting the paid messages. So those are the two options that we could do. We can add buttons, we could uh, open a website, and we can go to a flow. So for example, if you want to send a more complicated flow, this is what you would do. You would uh, do the message, and then people would click on the button, and then they could get into whatever flow you want them to get into. Maybe it's uh, information for your new program or maybe it's the information of the new sale of your products, or it's the new webinar or your new product, whatever it is. Whatever it is that you want the, them to co get connected to, this is where you send it. Uh, this is where you connect it, go to a flow. And if you just want them to go to a website, just click here, um, open website. So that's the options that you have. So let's uh, select open website. We're gonna add my website. Uh, Chatmarketinglab.com. Check out replay here. Check out replay. And then we're gonna add an emoji. I'm actually gonna add it from here. This extension is called Joy Pixels. It's really useful because it has all of the pixels available. So we go there and we're gonna click on done. We're gonna delete this message because we only want this message and we're gonna say, um, we noticed you had interest in my master class. Have you seen it yet? And we can personalize it too. We're gonna add their name. And I ran, uh, and we only have a one character left. So basically that's all I could do. Um, we have limited amount of characters. We can add, not add more than one message. It's just one message and the card. That would be a second message and that's it. We can add a quick reply. We cannot add quick replies. That's it. Then we go to the blue button here on the top right hand corner. We click on next. We select the audience. In this case, there's zero people on this bot. So we're not gonna be able to send it, but we select the audience. Okay, now how do we select the audience? Well, you have to tag them, all right? Now this warning is gonna show up if you have less than 200 subscribers, you cannot send paid messages. Basically, that's the restriction we got. 
um, to avoid the risk of poor message delivery, Facebook recommends custom audience to contain not less than 200 subscribers. And it says, please grow your target audience and try later. So we're gonna got it. We're gonna click on got it. Anyways, if you have more than 200 subscribers, which you probably do, um, this is, I'm not using this chat bot, by the way, just so you know, <laughs> I have, I'll show you another fan, another chat bot. So you see that I have a lot of subscribers on the other fan pages. It's just, this one is new and we haven't even promoted it at all. So this is brand new out of the, out of the bag. Um, so I could do the tutorials as well from scratch. So yeah, anyways, um, subscribe to the channel so you can get more tutorials like this to help you grow your business online with chatbot marketing and customer service tips and tricks. So um, I'm going to keep uh, giving you a tour here. Um, we got the budget where you select the budget. You can go from one up to, I don't know if you could put a thousand dollars. Let's see. Yep, it allows you to have a thousand dollar budget. It's not gonna spend it all. You can put it, but it's not gonna spend it all. And then uh, bid control um, says Facebook will aim to spend your entire budget and get the most replies using the lowest cost per bid. You don't have to add anything here. You could say a dollar. Um, I would leave it blank. I don't know if you can leave it blank. And then um, you gotta add a start and finish sending period. So if you're pressing with time, if you have a launch going on and there's a holiday coming up and you're going to have a, an, an offer going on, whatever it is, start sending the messages with time. Do not think that this is the fast way solution to send a broadcast to everybody. It's going to take its time. It's not going to send it all at once. It's going to need a period where Facebook will try to deliver all of your messages. And I say try to deliver because some of the messages won't be delivered. That's how it is, okay? Um, we cannot work around it. That's how it is. Once we've set up all of this, we click on the publish button and we send the message. That's how we send the paid messages through ManyChat and the sponsored messages that Facebook calls them sponsored messages. It's the same as paid messages on ManyChat. It's the same thing, same thing. So I hope that you like this tutorial. If you would like more, if you want to know more about ManyChat, about messenger bots, about uh, funnels, neuromarketing, neuromarketing, anything that uh, pertains technology, let me know in the comments below. I would love to read your comments. I would also love to do videos based on your guys' comments because that will help us, everybody in the community, right? Be a better communicator and use the chat marketing strategies the best way we can. So thank you so much for being here. I will see you in the next video. Remember to subscribe with the little bell and check out the other videos in my channel so you can learn more about chat marketing, neuromarketing, customer service tips and tricks, and more techie tutorials for your business to become irresistible online. I will see you in the next one. Ciao, ciao, ciao.